everyone, Abby here. Welcome to Little Red Alice. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Today I'm going to be doing my July favorites. So basically some clothing and some products that I really enjoyed this past month. I've been really looking forward to making this video for a while. If you like what you see today, make sure to give this video a thumbs up and make sure to hit subscribe so you can stay up to date on everything Little Red Alice related. And if you don't like what you see, still hit that subscribe button and leave a comment down below telling me what you would like to see in the future. And then when I do it, you'll be the first one to know. It's a win-win situation, guys. I see only pros. What am I doing with my hands? I'm gonna just, I'm gonna move on. The first item on my favorites list is this black leather choker from Zara that I'm actually wearing right now. I love it. It is so cute, so versatile. I wear it with almost every outfit. It's actually getting to the point where I have to stop myself from putting it on because it's literally become my go-to accessory. It's also really nice about this choker is that you can still layer long necklaces over it and not have it distract the action going on up here. The next item on my favorites list is also something I'm wearing right now and it's this amazing off-the-shoulder floral top from Topshop. Now before this summer I had never worn off-the-shoulder tops or anything of the sort but I have fallen in love with the look and the style and just the ease and comfort of wearing a shirt like this. They're flattering on virtually anyone but it's a really easy way to show off a little bit of skin even if you're feeling a little insecure or uncomfortable. The next item on my favorites list is the Benefit Porefessional Matte Rescue Primer. Now I have really oily skin so not only is it imperative for me to prime my face but to find a product that is made specifically for someone with oily skin and keep your face shine free. A little goes a long way. You really only need a dime sized amount and it covers your entire face and gives you the coverage you need to slather on as many layers of makeup as you want and still give you that matte clean dry look. So the next product on my list is the Tony Moly VC Dacian Cushion Plus Cushion Compact. I'm not sure exactly if that's the correct phrasing. I'm pretty sure it's something like that. But basically, this is an amazing cushion compact created by Tony Moly, which is a Korean makeup brand. For those of you who don't know what a cushion compact is, they are all the makeup rage. They started with Korean makeup a while ago, actually, but recently they've started to become more mainstream. They look like this. They look like any sort of uh, compact. You pop the lid open and you have a mirror like any other compact and you have this little sponge applicator which you pick up like this with your fingers. As you can see this little compartment opens and this reveals another sponge that is completely doused in either BB cream, CC cream, primer, foundation. I've actually seen some blushes now. Basically whatever product you want and you use the sponge applicator, dab out how much product you need and then apply it all over your face. So at the beginning of the summer, I was looking for a foundation, but I didn't want anything too heavy, so I started looking at BB creams and CC creams, and while I was at the Tony Moly store in Koreatown, New York, I came across this. A BB cream meets a CC cream. So it has the full coverage of a BB cream, but it feels so lightweight like CC cream. Not only does it feel light, but it's buildable, so you can work in layers. So if you want a light coverage that day, it's so easy to control how much product you're putting on your face with this sponge. Also really nice about this product is that it's SPF 50, so again, perfect for the summer. So the next item on my list is the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush in the shade Sweet. So I actually got this in a Tarte collection gift set type thing from Ulta. So this is like the mini size. The full Amazonian clay 12 hour blushes are a little bit bigger than this. I'm probably gonna end up buying the full one once I run out of this. Anyway, love this blush. It's perfect for summer. I don't really wear highlighter that often, especially in the summer. What I like about this Tarte blush is that it has a little bit of a glow while still being pink like blush. The next item on my list is another Korean makeup product from the brand Too Cool For School and this is the Dino Platz Escalator Mascara which I think is the cutest name ever. First of all the packaging is so cute. They have these little cartoon dinosaurs all around. I think this is a Brontosaurus is the one with the long neck right? Yeah it's this huge Brontosaurus. These tiny other dinosaurs following behind him and the font for Too Cool for School is just, it's perfect. Looks like whoever wrote it didn't care, which I think is hilarious. I just find it so funny that this is called Escalator Mascara because that's what I feel like it really does. I have pretty much non-existent lashes, so I need all the help I can get in the eyelash department. I really feel like every time I wear it, my lashes are lifted up. It's also really buildable. It also lasts really long, and this one isn't waterproof, but 
I've noticed that my mascara stays on the whole day. Next on the favorites list is the Benefit Browsing's Total Taming and Shaping Kit for Brows. So I was at Ulta early this month and I saw the huge Benefit Brow Collection display where I tried to find a product that I thought was the most versatile. What I decided on was this. It comes with pretty much everything. So first off, it comes with a brow gel, a brow powder. It comes with this cute little brush here, which is two brushes, but actually folds open to one big brush. What's also nice is it comes with a mini pair of tweezers. So let's say you're doing your makeup on the go and you bring this little kit with you and you notice a few brow hairs out of place, you can just pluck them on out. I definitely recommend this if you're looking for just one product to help groom and tame your brows. Next item on my favorites list is the NYX Liquid Suede Lipstick in the shade Life's a Beach. It's actually what I'm wearing right now. Funny thing is I've actually had this lipstick for a while but I never got around to wearing it because I thought the shade might be too light but I was actually so pleased with how this color turned out. It's this really lovely pink salmon-y color that's actually brighter than I thought it would be, but still I love it. I intended to use this shade as like a casual day shade, but I feel like you could wear it as a dramatic shade or with a dramatic look as well. Also the name Life's a Beach is just so fitting for the summer. It's kind of funny how this has become my summer and July go-to shade. If you haven't tried the NYX Liquid Suede lipsticks, they are incredible. It's the perfect balance between a liquid lipstick and a regular lipstick. Sometimes I'll wear a liquid lipstick and when I take it off, my lips are chapped for days. But what's really nice about this is that's not the case. My lips don't feel dry or chapped after wearing this. And even though this doesn't dry completely matte, it still has such long wearability. The last item on my favorites list is actually a makeup removing product and it is the Neutrogena Hydrating Eye Makeup Remover Lotion. So I'm someone who wears a lot of eye makeup every day and I always use a special product to take it off. The skin around your eyes is really delicate and to constantly scrub the area around your eyes with a makeup wipe is not really good for the delicate skin surrounding it. So before getting this, I had been using liquid eye makeup remover from Neutrogena and while it was effective at getting all the makeup off, I noticed that the skin around my eyes was still dry. When I ran out of that at the beginning of the summer, I went ahead and got this just to try it out. So not only does this lotion do an amazing job of completely breaking down the eye makeup and getting everything off, my eyes haven't been dry since using this product. It's amazing, I'm so happy about it. So thank you guys so much for watching my July favorites video. Again, if you liked what you see, make sure to click that thumbs up button and hit the subscribe. A list of all the products mentioned in this video, along with a link of where to buy them and find them, will be included in the description box below. All right, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!